Welcome to my podcast, Apollonia Studio 6. What was your first big movie break? I would say Fast Times at Ridgemont High. Man. I mean, even though I had a, a small role in it, I mean, mm -hmm. it was the first big studio. Yeah. It's not a small role. Well, You're I, mean, that, I mean, come on. So, t okay. Go ahead. I am all excited. <laughs> so, uh, so that was, of course, an uh, iconic film. Yeah. And what was like a, what's a great fast time story for you? Wow. Oh, gosh. Okay, well, there's a couple. Okay. And the 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 one thing I'm going to say before a story, the thing that I think is so interesting about Fast Times yes. is that literally every single actor in that movie mm -hmm. either went on to do three things. Mm -hmm. Huge movie stars, mm -hmm. journeyman character actors like me, mm -hmm. or left the business and are hugely successful. Like, it's just the most successful <laughs> list of people yes. in... I mean, the the movie stars from that is just insane. Yeah. Um, but I remember um, uh, doing a scene in the burger stand, and um, I looked up, and, and Sean Penn had come in to watch. And I was like, I went over, I was like, what are you doing? And he's like, I, wanna, I like watching you work. Mm. I was like, all right, that's cool. Mm -hmm. oh. Yeah, so I was like, because he was so cool. And, yeah. um, and, and a lot of the young people in that film were from New York and you know I was this California kid so I felt like a little not as as hip as the rest of the people so I I thought that he was incredibly cool and um well, you guys were similar though you and Sean because he was Malibu kid he was yeah. born in Santa Monica yeah both surfer kid yeah yeah he was really nice and actually everybody on that set was really mm. nice and then I have to say but the the most fun scene to film um was the dance scene at the end to um, Moni Moni. Oh, yes. Mm -hmm. Oh, my gosh. It really felt like you were at the most <clears throat> fun party. And I love Eric Stoltz, and I got to dance with him the whole time. I just, I adore him. He's such a, a great actor and a good person. Um, and um, and just every day with Amy Heckerling, it was mm -hmm. like having, like, the coolest big sister mm -hmm. um, on the set. Yeah. And, oh, and one day... Because uh, Cameron Crowe wrote mm. it, obviously. Um, Nancy came to the set. Oh, wow. And I was like, <laughs> um, uh, I can't even do anything. Because that was just, she, they were so hugely iconic. Mm -hmm. yeah. Heart. Yeah. yeah I'm just blathering. Just Nancy. <laughs> um, and so that might be also another really yes. fun day. Yes. Of, of Which neither have anything to do with acting in the movie, <laughs> but... How well, those fun. are great, though. Those are the those are the memories. Those yeah, are the, think about those now. Yeah. You did a, a an anniversary, and it came out. And was it Newsweek or Time? There was something that came out, and yeah. you had to do a they had to do a class reunion photo. Mm. Oh, Vanity Fair. Van. Oh, I know. It was the it was yes. for like the uh, the Oscar issue, or, or I think it was. I forget. Yeah, because I know after we did it, I got invited to the Vanity Fairs. Vanity Fairs, the Vanity Fairs, <laughs> the Vanity Fair, the Vanity after Fairs, party. Oscar party, at Vanity <laughs> Fair. <clears throat> um, but um, yeah, that was really fun to go do and see. Everybody. Oh, so you went to the that year? You got to go to the party. I didn't go. Oh, I didn't go because I was filming and I couldn't go. Oh, well, that's um, good. You're working, so it's okay. Yeah, but um, but it, that was the only time I've ever been invited. <laughs> I should have gone. Yeah. I should have just like called in sick. Like, I'm sorry, I can't come to the set today. I have to go to the Vanity Fair Oscar party. <laughs> so that shoot, what was that like? Seeing everybody, you know, older, married, you know, some successful. So were every, was everybody there? Everybody was there except for I think um, Phoebe, Jennifer, and one other person. Were photo they were filmed in New York and photoshopped in. Uh, but yeah, a lot of the people was, every, was think, Sean there that day. Sean was there that day. Good for him. Um, everybody <laughs> was there, and and it was interesting. It was like um, everyone was sort of shy and really? and uh, uh, quiet in a way, yeah. but happy to see one another. But right. what it wasn't like. Um, it was very reserved. Mm. Um, you know, it was, yeah. you know, a lot of years had passed. Yeah. Forrest Whitaker. <clears throat> oh, he is Forrest just dreamy. Forrest Whitaker in there. Oh, when you... I had the biggest crush on Forrest Whitaker. He was so funny oh, in that. Oh, God. my God. He's so good in everything. Yeah. Everything. 
Forrest, I'd love to be in a movie that you direct. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> really just, I love his work. Yeah. I just, and he is just so gentle. Yeah, yeah. chill. He's gentle. That voice. Yes. His voice. I just find him, they, the way he speaks, he's thoughtful and it's like he sees through you a mm-hmm. little bit and he's, he can mind the truth. Yeah. And I think as an actor, getting to work with somebody mm-hmm. that's going to look at you like that right. to help you find your most authentic beat yep. I, I in a calm way. Yeah. yeah. I don't know. Anyway. Yeah. That's, God, how lucky. Now, you still maintain like friendship. I think you're still friends with Jennifer, Jason. I'm not. I mean, we're acquaintances. We yeah. were friendly for a while. Um it's weird throughout the years. Different. I was friends with Eric for a while, mm-hmm. and I mean, we all are friendly when we see each other. But right. then it doesn't. Yeah. But um, I see Kelly Maroney sometimes. Mm-hmm. I see. Um, now I can't think of anybody. So, like, so different times through the years, we all, you know, it's always fun to run yeah. into one another. But right. I think that the two that really stayed close friends are Phoebe and Jennifer. I think mm-hmm. that they they forged a friendship that wow, has lasted wow. this whole. Lasted all these years. Welcome to my podcast. Apollonia Studio 6. 